Hey, hey, hey. Good morning. Morning, morning. Morning, morning. Happy Tuesday. Just doing my little cool down. Just got up and walked. Well, let me take that back. I just got up and ran for 30 minutes. I walked like five. Um, I woke up late. I didn't get in the gym till like 5.15. So I was like, okay, I'm late. So I got to go and run this out. Um, I so did not want to. Like, seriously, I so didn't want to. But I had to because it was my fault that I was late because I didn't want to get up. And I'm saying all this because in my mind, I was telling myself, Brittany, it's just Tuesday. You could put it off to tomorrow. It's just Tuesday. You ain't, you ain't, don't sweat. You know, you ain't got to do it today. That's what I was telling myself. But I didn't come in the gym yesterday because I had to be to work at six o'clock yesterday morning. So I wasn't able, my timing was all off. But that little voice came in my head today was like, you ain't got to do it. Just put it off to tomorrow. Just do it tomorrow. <laughs> And I just went on and got up because I'm like, I didn't want to keep doing it. You know, I feel like the spirit was telling me a while back when I when I used to say that one day it was just saying the nerve of you, you know, <laughs> to think that you got to tomorrow to do it. And, you know, that's just what I wanted to say today. Like, a lot of us, we wait till the new year, you know. A lot of people waiting till January 1st to start stuff. And I'm just telling you, y'all, what are you waiting on? <laughs> what are you waiting on? Get your butt up and start today. Get your butt up and start today. Stop waiting on what everybody else is doing. Stop thinking and yes life i feel like we all gonna have a long life as long as the creator let us but stop thinking you got it like that to where you can wait to tomorrow <laughs> you know why continue to put that off for yourself like that's what i was telling myself and i'm telling you that little voice is evil <laughs> that little voice to have you thinking yeah yeah just wait till tomorrow and tomorrow it's gonna be another excuse. And then another excuse. And then you gonna turn around and you ain't did nothing in a week, you know? And I'm telling you, when you trying to start and missing a day or two in the gym, boy. Whew, or even if you're working out at home, just missing a day or two, boy. That That's, hey, it ain't easy. It ain't easy at all, so. And I'm not just saying this about workout. I'm saying this about life, whatever you're trying to do. You know, if missing a day or two is going to put you behind, you know, for yourself. You ain't, it ain't you trying to compete with nobody else, but stay on track with what you said you was going to do. Because missing that one day or them few hours or whatever you, however you got your routine set up, it affects you. You know, because you can't get that day back. You can't get those hours back. So, that's why I'm saying start today, y'all. The new year starts now. Your, your new year starts now, you know. Your new year is today. <laughs> so, start today. You know, start today. I was uh, reading in Peter. It's Peter. I think it's Peter 3 and eight and it was saying that uh, thou, a day to God is like a thousand years so you know we think we have this day and we think we could just miss this day and you just if, if our stuff was like that like uh, one day is to like a thousand years <laughs> like so you missing one day you missing a lot of days, <laughs> you know, like the, you missing a lot, you know, and it, it just made me think too of creating, like, what are you creating today? You know, like, I know I have to be creating something every day. Cause it's just like, 
and not expecting it to be great tomorrow <laughs> because one day is like a thousand years to God. So, you know, we expect to start some today and then it be completed <laughs> next week or be completed in a year. That's not how it works. That how, that's not how creation works, you know. In the Bible, it talks about God created the world in seven days. But, yeah, to us, it's reading seven days. But if, a, if, but if one day is a thousand years to God, I don't think it was really seven days. <laughs> You know, but you can, you know, you could go see and read it for yourself and get your own revelation on that. But the point I'm saying, start today. Because time, you know, the nerve of us to think that we have that kind of time to play with, you know. You just don't want to waste any time or any days or any minutes or any seconds, you know. So just start. Start today. Start today.